Good morning everyone, welcome to the Two-Headed Wolf Gaming Channel. My name is Chris and I hope that you are ready, because I am ready and Gafram is ready to end this campaign by taking on the Norman fleets that are just about to land on our shores. It's been a long time in the making, but we are ready for them. We're gonna fight them bravely and they won't have a chance against us at this point. So let us move our fleets forward to protect the land, bring some of these troops back, let's take out West CX as well, or Wessex. There we have it, our long-standing enemy has now been vanquished. Well, almost, they have only one more army right here. Let's take a look at the rest of our generals. Guthrum will stay in position. He finally has a chance to fight the Normans. For the rest of the troops, I think they're well in position. Like, they're where they need to be. We won't be doing anything special there. Let's take a look at Linden Siege. They have a brand new slot. Let's see, where does the town expand once we build this? And one of the things I like to see in the Total War games, especially since Rome 2 Total War, is that whenever you build a building, like when you expand your city, like it expands the walls as well and it builds some houses around. I don't know, it's, it's a little touch. It gives me that vibe of the city building, right? Of actually seeing your city being built. So let's see over here, uh, we could go for a trader or merchant or we could build a craft trader increasing our income from pottery, cloth and salt building. Since we do have quite a bit of pottery, we will be doing a craft trader. So let's see the town expand. And there you have it. <laughs> it's, it's something very small but I love it. And we will go ahead and build a great market over here. Linden Seed has become the best town we have. SCX is attacking us. We're just going to give him a quick battle. To honor their bravery. Or their foolishness. Done. Let's check what the Normans will be doing. If they're going to continue to stick together or not. So they are actually attacking one of our towns. Hmm. You know what? I don't think we could do a whole lot against them right here. Uh, yeah, I don't think it, there is... I don't want to make this episode about fighting pointless battle we will see their troops as soon as soon as we start fighting them so they're bringing two fleets over to the left side they're really gathering around here bathroom provides security lavish Austere, prepared for battle. Heroic level 3. Gain from the forge or Starforgeshire forge building chain. Plus 15% armor, plus 1 zeal and plus 1% to damage to sword and axe infantry. Hmm. Okay, that's an interesting trait to keep in mind. Maybe if we keep a general in the area, this will happen also. Yeah, they're really marching all, all their fleets here. We can't. How should not we do this? We'll like, this does he have night battles? He does not. So this army does not have night battles. We finished having trained cavalry. So now we can upgrade Let his archer go. units. And also Jarl's horsemen. This is our next unit in the list. 
for you, your army is quite depleted. I am going to advance you into the next town. Gafram is a bit mad <laughs> because they do not want to fight us. But you know, what can you do? We're just gonna march on the left side and bring all these armies together. Ready for battle! For you. Okay, Gafram, you go to the left as well. And I am going to bring the Thunderer Swords here. Let's upgrade all this cab. And they're a lot tougher. Maybe it would have been a great idea to upgrade them early on. Not for the future, I guess. We'll see this through. Research. What do we want to go for next? We could go for Master Horseman. That might be an idea. We could go ahead and upgrade our spears. I think we will do that. Let's upgrade our spears because I saw some cav units we can't. here. We can't. Can't that we seemed can't. quite tough. For Bertrand, this general of ours, we can give him... Yeah, one more point in the champion. Let's upgrade these units and let's move him as well towards the front line. Not possible. Hey, I think that's about it for now. We take a look at our buildings. Linden Siege, let's upgrade the farm as well, make this area very rich. This is our second one. I'm not really looking to upgrade this area. Okay. I think we'll keep the money. Let's end the turn. Let's have some coffee. Perfect. Or not that perfect. So what do they have here? They have a bunch of spears. It might have been a good idea to actually fight them earlier in the siege battle to reduce some of their units. It's gonna be tough. I'll give them that. Especially since the general is not a great one. Not a tough one. And you know what? No pain, no gain. We are at the end of the game. We're trying to, first of all, reduce some of their troops, make them take a lot of casualties, hopefully win if we can, but if not, we definitely want to weaken them just enough to where we can bring in our other armies. Let's see, what do they have? So their spears, two of their spears are level, level three. These swords are level 3, these swords are level 3 as well, they are quite tough. Their archers aren't great, the crossbow, I know they are anti-armor, so we have to be careful with that. And their retinue melee cap is strong as well. Plus they have reinforcements. So, let's take a look at their army. Let's check their composition a little bit. These are the Norman troops. Very heavily armored. Even some of these troops in the back. And here is their cav. Pretty nice looking. But so are we. <laughs> Spearmen! Spearmen, you st stay on the side. The you stay on the side as well. Oh, let's check the Jarl's cavalry cav here, right? That's nice. They're looking really cool. They have these kinds of spears that we have in Battle Brothers as well. Yeah, we're gonna use them to the best of our abilities. And we're gonna try to do a lot of damage on the enemy. How should we do this? Uh, these are scary, so we're gonna put them in the center. Their crossbow. Yeah, they keep their crossbow in front. 
I almost Where want to put... Pipe? I think Axeman. that's what I'll do. I'll put this weaker Axeman in the front to take the brunt Axeman. of their Sword arrows. Uh, hope, because we don't want their crossbow to actually hit our tougher troops. I'll bring this javelin. I don't care too much for the javelin unit, so I'm gonna bring it in front as well. Our archers are in position, our general will be behind them. And well, let's start the battle. Command us! I'm gonna move them in front. Let's make them go into shield wall. Bowman, you shoot here. For you, I want you to do that. Is this tough enough? No, they're not. So the cav doesn't seem to be tough enough as far as, you know, stats go. We are going to charge the normal knight. We're taking missile fire, but we are in shield wall. So that is good. We're bringing our spears in. Nice. Our their crossbowmen has been have been decimated there. They've broken. Let's shoot their other crossbowmen, especially since they've gathered up like this. Scout, I'm gonna remove the scout cavalry from here. Oh, they're bringing their other unit. Actually, let's keep the spears over to this side because they have more cavalry. Okay, let's do it like this. We're trying to take advantage of the AI not being too tough. I guess I'll have to bring the other spear unit. Uh, I'll take the scouts once again out of this battle. Because they're gonna charge us here. Our javelins are taking quite a bit of damage, but that is okay. We want we want uh, them to use and waste their ammo there. Okay, so now they are approaching us with the intent. With the intent of actually taking us down. Let's break formation, let's charge them. Let's bring the tougher units inside as well. Let's scare them. We're gonna use these two units on the side. Yeah, five knights won't have a chance against us. Let's bring up the general uh, for you for our archer units. For our archers units, let's take on the normal archers or no, the Flemish crossbowmen. Okay, bring them in. Bring our troops here. Come on, hurry up. We need them. We need you in the battle. Good. We've broken another cab there. We have only one more. We should actually move our scouts out of the way. Okay, you. You're coming here and be behind them. Those are two scarls. Good. 
Scouts, Scouts, you come here. Let's see, what can we do with you? We could really force them here. Um, great, so this cav is breaking. Let's take on this Flemish crossbowman there. There's some more here. Bring the spearman on this side. Okay, what's this? Archers, archers, Flemish crossbowmen, so there's more crossbowmen there. Oh uh, yeah, let's keep them busy here. You. How are we doing here? We're doing okay, but they don't seem to be all engaged. More, more. I want... I want these units to break. I want their archers to break. Come on. Take them on. Engage more. Make sure that everybody is engaged in this fight. Um, yeah, shoot there. This cap broke them. Now attack here. Okay. You go there. More archers. Some foot soldiers. Okay, so some of these axes here actually broke. We're doing pretty well. We're doing pretty well. As long as our general survives, we're okay. Though this battle is pretty tough for him as well. Come on, break this unit. They are quite tough there. Okay, let's retreat our general. Just so he keeps the flank up. What did we catch here? Archers, archers. Some sword infantry is coming here. Our men have rallied. Okay, men have rallied. Where are they? Where are they? They're right here. The enemy general is dead. Perfect, perfect. You go. Run, 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 run. Okay, the Jarl Cav is free. Let's bring them here. Let's do some charges. What's here? Some Norman Fuscarls? They have a... Let's shoot in the back of those troops. So that's... Uh, uh, that's not a really successful charge right there. Okay, we kept these units in check for as long as we could have. Yeah, well, what can you do? Oh, we forgot about these troops. They got free over here. Let's bring these swords, these axemen. We're gonna bring them here on the side. And we're gonna charge this unit in there. Let's bring our king over to this side. Norman foot soldiers. Let's put them like this and do a quick charge on them. Now they are definitely quite tough, so it's a bit more difficult to break them. Berserk! 
Berserkers are doing really well, despite the fact that they are overwhelmed. You, charge there. Anything else that's left in this forest? Not the archers. So that's that, let's take them out, take them out of the battle, because they're pretty tough. So yeah, it's unfortunate we do not have a good abilities. Our Anglian champions Come broke on, there. Quicker the pace! Turn around! Haste in yourself! See! They flee before oh, our might! Fall. Ready for war! End them! Horsemen! Speak it up! Okay, let's see if we can actually change to... Can we change to fire arrows here? And try to break their morale? The battle is no Let's longer in our favor. Take some charges there. Our cab broke. Swordsmen! Swordsmen! Got the Let's see, where is this unit? Okay. Well, let's bring this unit here. They're not gonna do much, that's for sure. Oh. <sighs> We've done, truth be told, we've done really well, given the circumstances. Look at that. We've broken their troops. Now they're, oh, these troops went berserk, our berserkers went berserk, so. <laughs> we can't do much about that. Routing. Our foes will fall. Our men run Our from the enemy. Men. This is shameful. Yeah, yeah. Bowman. Let's see. You, you come here, strike their back, or strike this area. Move it, man. Got them. We're gonna fight to the last man. Battle orders. Swordsmen. They are breaking, which is good. Uh. So our general has fallen. These guys are berserkers and they're out of control. But they are immune to fear, so. Where's the fight? State your orders. <laughs> Got that. Up the pace, man. The enemy reveals. Commanders. Crush Let's them. say we're doing very freaking death. well here. Hurry! Shift it. Got that. Brain dead. I've nothing left. Berserkers are <laughs> just doing a number on these guys. Look at that. They're like they're, they're kicking ass and taking names, right? And they're cheering and they're Man, we were so close. Now they're feeling it. Unfortunately we lost. But we were this so close. Let's take a look at their last stand over here. As they're being surrounded. Smash them! But we've done a great number on them. them down. They have this big advantage of having all their troops in one place. Which will help them advance. Smash them! 
However, like look at this being surrounded by five units and a bunch six units and they're still fighting. I should have brought in more berserker units to tell the truth. Probably that the front we have a weak front line, right? With those we had the weak front line with those axes. And we were fighting two two different armies. The bow is running away! Yeah. Let's fast forward. As they all perish. All hope is lost. All hope is lost in this battle. But we've done well. So they've deployed 3000 troops and we killed 2500 of them. We've deployed 1600 and we've lost most of our army. So they did good. They did as good as they could have in this situation. Here is our first big loss in this game. So they sacked the settlement, okay, huge Dane invasion fleet has arrived in the north of East Britannia. Let's see, is it close to us? <laughs> okay. Here I thought we were going to complete this campaign and now I have to realize that I am not prepared. I thought that they would only come from the south. Apparently I was very wrong. Let's see. Yep. Let's bring in some tough units. And what else should we do? We should probably recruit one more general here. We have Einar. Let's recruit you, man. What would we change actually? You can rely on us. The time for we'll that put him come. in and give him all these units. Hopefully they'll replenish just enough. Though we they come. might reach... Yeah, so they do reach no. our Not ports in one turn with most of the troops. Uh, can I take you out of town now? Yeah. So I'll Ready keep him out of we town as reinforcements and keep inside the town our biggest armies. Hey, you bow. march north. Salt pans to the south of here. Okay. Is this the place that got... No, this Never. is not the place that Proceed got sacked. I am going to bring a troop there. Ready for battle. You, what can you do? You can reach this place. Gofram, are you ready? Because I want to bring you in. Guess we'll have to keep two armies on our side at each step for you. Go inside this town. Get yourself. Well, I don't have any more units. And they've just sacked this settlement. Let's try to bring someone in here as well. Upkeep for spears. Or missile infantry. Let's put him like this. Give him four skirmishers. And try to create another army here. That's about all the time we have for today. We had a great battle over here. Unfortunately, we lost. We're probably going to... It's going to take us a little bit to push all these armies back. To fight them all, since they are quite tough. And now we also have the Danes. No. No. We can't. Coming here in here and trying we to can't. take over. Never. So, yeah, I guess that's that. 
I guess I'm surprised that we have another invading army. But we are going for the long victory. For the ultimate victory. Though we don't complain about that, we just get things done. I thank you very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Have a wonderful day everyone.